The three key things I remember from my graduate school real estate class when it comes to buying a home is the location, the location, and oops, I forgot number three. Location. Proximity is key. Are you near a body of water? How's the view? Any schools nearby? How's the crime? Stay tuned and I'll show you one up and coming neighborhood in North Dallas, Texas. One of the reasons I moved to Texas is because of the housing. There is really nice homes in the state of Texas. You can basically get a lot of square footage for your money. So we're going to head down Main Street is where we are. And we're going to check out some of the newer housing communities. Stay tuned. We are coming up on a fairly new community on the left-hand side. Homes are being built and the name of this community is called Edgetone. So across the street you can see these homes have already been completed. And then just newer homes coming up on the left. So let's go take a look. All right, to give you a closer look, these homes start off at the mid 900s to $1.6 million. There's um, some availability here on the left, looking behind me. There are several availability signs behind me, uh, but I noticed when I look to the right, those are all sold. So, not too much availability left. This is a great area. If you look in the distance behind me, there is a high school. And then if I keep walking, there's actually an elementary school. I'll flip the camera so you all can see. Elementary school actually in the distance, but overall a really good community that you'd wanna check out. Um, but it's best to get here sooner rather than later. So let's go ahead now and we're gonna cross the street because I wanna show you what a finished community looks like. Um, so you can kind of see the difference as to, you know, where there, these homes actually are and what the finished product will be. Let's go ahead and head across the street. This is the finished product of the homes. These are actually smaller ones. Uh, notice on this end, these are more of the smaller homes. So these will be on your lower level pricing. On this end, the homes start to get larger. So this would be more at the upper end of the pricing that we saw earlier. And here's actually one that was actually sold. Um, so this community is pretty much fairly done with this home in front of us being the last home that was sold. Back to the proximity that I was referring to, you're pretty much right down the street from the Dallas North Toll. The street up above is Legacy. And here we are coming up at the DNT. Thanks for hanging around to the end. So one of the things that I knew when it came time to buying a home is I wanted to ensure I had no debt. A fully funded emergency fund and a down payment. Now some may say that you wanna have at least 20% down to avoid paying the PMI, the acronym is private mortgage insurance. But for me, in my situation, I want 100% down because I am not trying to go to nobody's credit union. Notice I said credit union, not bank. 
and apply for any loan to be paying anybody back for the next 15 years. So you'll want to turn on your notifications for my finance videos because I'm going to share with you step by step. Know how I did it and you can do it too.